Hostage situation at the bar. Have you ever had that one night out which starts with laughter and ends with a 911 call? It was a Friday night, the air thick with laughter and music pulsating through our favorite dive bar hangout spot. My buddy, Jake, and I were stuck in the all-too-common ritual of waiting for our turn in the unisex bathroom. We joked about how the line resembled a red carpet event. A host of faces flushed from one too many drinks, anticipating their moment in the lime green, dingy light of the restroom. As Jake and I were debating the best way to speed up the process, a rough-looking man dashed past the line. There was a wild desperation in his eyes that we didn't recognize until it was too late. As the door swung open, he roughly shoved Jake inside, slamming the door behind them. For a moment, we all just stood there, stunned into silence by the unexpected turn of events. Then, from behind the door, we heard raised voices, a sharp edge of fear in Jake's tone that sent chills down my spine. The laughing crowd suddenly turned into a sea of alarmed faces, the joyous atmosphere now heavy with fear. I quickly alerted the bartenders, my voice trembling as I recounted the shocking incident. Their faces drained of color as they immediately dialed 911. Meanwhile, the muffled demands for money and drugs echoed from the locked bathroom, the man's voice like a jagged knife cutting through the tense silence. What should have been just another waiting game turned into a hostage situation. Our trivial complaints about restroom lines were replaced by silent prayers for Jake and whoever was unlucky enough to be in the bathroom with him. The liveliness of the bar turned to dread as we all waited for the police. When the sirens finally cut through the night, relief flooded through me. The police moved swiftly, their weapons drawn. The door was finally forced open, revealing Jake and a terrified stranger held at knife point by the now captured man. Jake walked out with an unnerving calmness, his face pale but determined. As the night eventually fell back into an uncomfortable silence, I couldn't help but replay the horrifying ordeal in my mind. The laughter, the music, everything seemed surreal, as if it belonged to another night, another reality. So, the next time you find yourself in a long bathroom line at a bar, remember to cherish the times when it's only a long wait.